Mouse and I Talk. This is the story of Peter Pan and a girl named Wendy who believed in him. It begins in the Darling Family Nursery.
say it again, I'm going to get Peter when he gets distracted. <laughs> Look at how amazing my shadow is. Now I just need to attach it to that. Oh my gosh, it's you! I knew you were real. I knew it, I knew it.
Great Lagoon. There's Go Up. And there's Captain Hook and the Pirates. Shooting cannons. I wonder what they're shooting at. Look out, they're shooting at us.
Greetings, people from across the ocean. Greetings! For many moons, we native braves have fought with you lost boys. True. Sometimes you win, sometimes we win. Okay, if you win this time, turn us loose. Turn us loose. You mean this is only a game? Yeah, and it sometimes seems a little ridiculous to talk about that. The important thing here is, where have you hit it, Tiger Lily? What? We ain't got the princess. Yes, you do. Tell me or else. Honest, no. That's a big people from across the ocean line. And Tiger Lily is not back by sunset. Boss boys get burned at the stake. <gasps> Uh, yes, Captain? 
Release the princess and take her back to her people. But which captain are you? The real Captain Hook. Okay, okay. I told him you idiots would betray Peter Pan. Here's your spirit, me! It's Pan! Come and get me! Load on the wire again, you cheap, insolent boy! I'll slap you to ribbons! You'll cut me to pieces? I'll slap you again! Not so fast! Peter! Wendy! In the bag, Captain. Cleave me the brisket! I've got you this time, Pan! I say, Captain.
fighting on me, fly away. I must fire for the boss boys lit. I must have revenge. Captain, pardon me for saying, but maybe you should just forget this whole pan business and never land to go back to a healthy life in the high seas, scheduling ships, cutting throats. Aye, but what flight through yonder window breaks? Feeling poetic, Captain? No, that one over there is Peter Pan's fairy, Tinkerbell. But why is she crying? Well, I wouldn't want this to go any further, but the cook told me that the first mate told him that Pan has banished Tinkerbell. You should have told me at once. This gives me a plan. But how will you get her to talk? I speak Pixie. <laughs> What's she saying? She says she's very depressed, poor thing. <laughs> they say here, he does not speak Pixie, by the way. Just now he said the turnip was taking a siesta. <laughs>
Mom tells the story of Pan. What did you say? Mom tells the story of Pan. Michael, if you don't think I'm actually your mother, John. Mom tells stories. You tell us stories. You must be our mother. But I've just been playing. You have a real mom at home. Michael, John, you remember? She has silky ears who work for coats. That was Nana. I think I had a mother once. I once had a white bed. I think it's time to go home. No, go home. Stay many moves. Have me fun time. Now, Peter, we've got to be practical. And Indian Braves don't even talk like that. Do you just want to stay here and grow up like savages? Savages! You need a real mom. Thank you. 
Children, how can you scare us like this? You've been gone all night. You've been gone all night. It's only been one night. Of course. Hush, George. Just be happy there. Wendy, you can stay in this room and tell stories for as long as you wish. No, Mom. The lost boys weren't ready. That's why they went back to Neverland. But I am. Oh, but Dad, it was amazing. Tinkerbell and the mermaids and Peter calling home the codfish. And we were kidnapped. But I knew Peter Pan would save us, even if he is conceited. And then we sailed home on a ship through the sky. And your stories are wonderful, Wendy. They are more than stories, Mom. We really flew. Ha! And you can fly too, Dad. It's true. Think of the happiest things. It's the same as having wings. Come on! Want me to fly? George, I take it back. Step away from the window.
Okay, so we have a few things okay, Kayla. Uh, to do before we let you go. So we'll start with our raffle. So the, we're going to pull out the ticket uh, for the winner of the canvas. I would like to have you help me out. Okay. It says Tammy, phone number 301536. 1200? Lauren. All right. And then the second one we pull out is going to be for the land because that was on the Captain Hooks. Thank you. 